Oh, are you there? <laughs> Hi, loves. Hope you're doing you're doing well today. So, today's lesson is going to to, uh, to be about how to reply to the one who asks you, "How are you?" In the previous lesson, we talked about how to say, "How are you, Nabi?" But we said it in general. So. What if you are talking to a female? Are you going to say "Give hala for a female? No. There is a very slight difference between how are you for a male and how are you for a female in Arabic. If you are, you are talking to a male, you would say "Give hala the same way we studied in the previous lesson. But if you are talking to a, a female, you would say Kif halik. Kif halik. So, if you are talking to a male, you'd say Kif halak. But, if you are talking to a female, you would say Kif halik. So, pretend that I'm the speaker and I'm talking to my friend, which is, um, who is a female. I ask her Kif halik. In order to reply to Kif halak to a male or give halik to a female, we have three ways. The, the first way is tamam for both male and female. The second way, way is wayis, wayis for a male means good or waisa for a female means also good. The same way goes for imnih, imnih for a male or imniha for a female. So I'm sure that you infer the rule already, which is by adding this sound for the female. Okay? So in order to reply for Kif halak or kif halik, you would say tamam for both male and female. Uh oh, sorry for this. So tamam for both male and female. Kwais for male or kwaisa for female. Nih for male. Niha for female. So to pretend that. I sold a conversation with one of, of my male friends. I would say, Kev Halak, he'd reply, Tamam, or Imni, or Kwais, or pretend that I start a conversation with, my, with one of my female friends, Kev Halak, she'd reply, Tamam, or Imni, or so this is all about today's lesson. If you like this video, please like, share, subscribe. Have a good day. Bye.